searching for the good in our neighborhoods and each other. Not just finding what's wrong, but what's right. A true reflection of Cincinnati. Find the good in your mornings. Good morning, Tri-State. This is WCPO 9 News. We thank you for choosing us. I'm Evan Millward. Here's a look at some of the top stories at this hour. Crews continue working around the clock to clean up after that 60 inch water main break in the east end. It continued today. The officials haven't determined what caused it to break or how long it's going to impact traffic and the homes in the area. Crews hope to start repairs on that main on Monday. Police gave us some new road closures as well to pass along. Riverside Drive will be closed from Delta to Collins Avenues, but police now say no trucks are able to pass between Baines and Delta. Collins has a railroad bridge and can't take trucks higher than 10 feet. A tri-state woman is facing charges after police say she sold fake documents at a local BMV office. According to investigators, Brittany Love, who works at the BMV on Hamilton Avenue, used fake power of attorney documents to issue car registrations for cash. They also say she shredded those documents once they were processed, but her alleged fraud was caught on camera. Sherry, it was colder today than it was yesterday, certainly a gloomy one. Yeah, that's right. We had that little wind kicking in there. We had a high of 38, but it felt more like mm, it's been in the low 30s. And we're at 30 degrees for tonight. We could see some areas of a little bit of freezing drizzle, so be careful out the door in the morning. It's mainly going to be a dry week, and we'll have above normal temperatures. Next big chance of some precipitation won't come until Thursday or Friday. But on Monday night into Tuesday, there could also be a little bit of a wintry mix for parts of the tri-state. Doesn't look like it'll be to be a big deal, but we'll be watching that. That, uh, as we go through the next 12 to 24 hours. It's going to be a quiet week. Our high temperatures for your Monday, again, will likely top out in the low 40s. I'm going to say about 43 or so with mostly sunny skies by the end of the afternoon.